Hello everyone, we are here today at St Andrews for this, the 2021 Varsity game between Edinburgh and St Andrews. Obviously no game here last year. In 2019 it was 62-0 to Edinburgh. So, will Edinburgh be as victorious today? We shall see. The atmosphere is brilliant here and we're set for a great game. So this is Paul Wilkinson, I'm here with EU TV and a hand-selected bunch of the loyal support for Edinburgh here today. Boys, what are we making of the match here today? Oh, we're very excited. We haven't had varsity in a couple of years, so I think everyone's raring to go. Um, we've had lots of preparation. We've pre-season for about a month now. We've had won every game we've played. Um, very looking forward to getting stuck in, as always. Um, and yeah, given what we've got. And uh, what do you think will be the key to the game today? I think if we just bring the intensity, they've got a few big boys that they've brought in from overseas, but nonetheless, I think we've, we've got more heart than they do. And at the end of the day, when we, when we bring the noise, they'll, they'll know who we are. And finally, what's the score predictions? Obviously, 62-0 last time the two sides faced. So, expecting a similar thing? I think it'll be a bit closer, but I'm not too worried. I'm going to go 40-15, Edinburgh. I'm joined by two St Andrews fans. Right, boys, what are we making of the game today? Well, I think we have to ignore the 62-0 previously. I think we have to... Different team, then? Different team. Yeah, different team. We've got a home ground advantage home now. Ground. The spirit will really come into it. I think that's been the most important thing, yeah. And do you think the atmosphere is going to play a big role today? Of course it is, absolutely. We're all here, jackets and ties. We've noticed Edinburgh, their side, are not wearing ties. So yeah. I think we're, we're definitely more up for it than they are. We're, we want it more. We are minutes away from kickoff here. The teams are about to come out. The atmosphere is building up nicely. Now let's see what happens on the pitch. Right, so I am here, half time, five all the score. I'm with the head coach of St Andrews, Scott. Scott, what did you make of the first half? First, it's just great to have sport, student sport back in such great numbers with crowds. It's, it's brilliant. It's been a, been a tough year for everybody, uh, and it's great just to mark the occasion with, with this great game. And obviously, a very tight game. Your scrum's been doing very well up against Edinburgh. Do you think that's going to be the key to the second half? I think, say, five all, it's been, a, it's been a great game, very competitive, and it's going to be a game with very fine margins. We've probably got the edge in the scrum with uh, Edinburgh scoring a mall try. It's going to be a, a really interesting second half. Well, best of luck the second half. Thank you very much, Scott. Any plans this evening? Yeah, it's going to be a big one, if we're honest. Um, yeah, we'll celebrate appropriately. And then moving forward in the rest of the season, what are, you, what are your expectations? What are you hoping for? Uh, we're looking to win the league, to be honest. Yeah, we're going to try and crack on from here. And yeah, take each game as it comes. So I'm joined here by St Andrews captain Isaac. Isaac, how are you feeling after that? Yeah, it's an unbelievable feeling. Um, I was on the, on the other side of it two years ago, so it's really one extreme to the other. I'm joined by head coach of the Edinburgh side, Dave. How are you feeling? Yeah, disappointed. It's kind of uh, a wee bit mixed, obviously. It's, it's been a great day for student sport. After 18 months of virtually nothing in the whole, whole country, to have a, an event like this uh, at St Andrews has, has been great. But on the pitch, maybe maybe not quite as, as buoyed and quite happy, but... Yeah, it's just been a good day, all right. So, 
It's all ended here at St Andrews in an 18 to 5 loss for Edinburgh. They did, didn't score in the second half, unfortunate, but only onwards and upwards from here. Thank you very much for watching and be sure to tune in in the future. Thank you. <laughs>